Hey, John Cristani here, internet multimillionaire, and can you really get 225,000 visitors to your website for $5? I do a little bit of investigation here. There have been some monster amounts of traffic that people are offering on Fiverr.com for $5. And I kind of address these and talk about them because I've seen an epidemic of this sort of traffic coming from my affiliates. Now here are affiliates of mine for example, Jim Jack sent 114,000 visitors to my website last month, yet not a single person even went through the process of, you know, went to the order form. Not a single person bought. And many people have the same experience where they sent 70, 50, 37,000 visitors with zero sales. Now, how does this happen? The fact of the matter is, I'm going to go into all of this and why the people sending the most traffic to my affiliate program oftentimes are not getting any results in terms of money on my program. And it's because of traffic sources like this. Let's get into it. I'll explain how this works and what else to watch out for when you're trying to get traffic advertising on the internet. <laughs> Hey, John Cristani here, and one of the biggest things that people starting out affiliate marketing or any sort of marketing online business need is traffic. How do you get visitors, right? How do you get people coming to your website? There's a lot of traps in going into this because there's a few considerations, right? You probably don't want to spend a lot of money and you don't want to learn new skills, right? So how do you get traffic if you don't want to learn how to do advertising and you don't want to spend a lot of money? Well, unfortunately, there are a lot of traps out there that for anything that people desire, there's somebody selling it. And I just did a search, I went to fiverr.com and I see a lot of affiliates making this mistake and they will purchase visitors. Who here has purchased traffic from Fiverr or from various other sites to jumpstart you know, visitors to their website? I'm sure many of you have. And here on Fiverr, you'll see just a relentless amount of offers here you know, 60,000 real targeted traffic for $45. You have 6,000 visitors for $5. You have 1,600 visitors with unique IPs for $20. You have 400,000 people to your website for $10. And you have 225,000 visitors to your website for $5. Now, does any of this work, you might be asking? Can this work even a little bit? Now, the answer is no, unfortunately not. A lot of these visitors, I'd take a really good guess at every single one of these is just pure spam traffic, okay? It's fake traffic. It's very easy to fake website traffic. And all it takes is for you to have a virtual machine visit a website and you can buy virtual machines for a few dollars or a few pennies you can start up a raspberry pi computer for 20 bucks and you have a unique residential ip address right so almost any metric in marketing can be faked or gamed somehow so you really need to be averse to that understand that this happens the problem with fake traffic is that because they're not real, they're not going to purchase anything on your site. Likely, you're not actually looking for traffic. What you're likely looking for is money or sales of your product. So if you're looking for sales of your product, you need real people. And that's why advertising networks such as Google, YouTube, Facebook, Pinterest, Twitter, etc., are such popular places to advertise is because they control their own visitors. You know that when you're advertising on YouTube that it's generally a real person that's going to be viewing your ad because Google has highly sophisticated knowledge of all of the ways that people try to game the system and they own these websites so they can really figure out what folks are doing. Same thing with Facebook. Facebook knows all of the ways that people might try to game the system. But the downside of these networks are is they take marketing skills or experience 
to be able to advertise on them and they also require money for instance i might spend anywhere from one to four dollars per click on YouTube to get traffic, to get visitors to my website. That's a lot of money. So I'm basically spending the same amount of money to get one visitor that people are paying for, you know, 400,000 visitors, okay? Which is just insane. You know, I'd rather pay $5 for one visitor from YouTube rather than 220,000 visitors from Fiverr. And the reason is, because at least with a visitor, I have more better chance to make that money back than if I just get fake traffic. I hope that makes sense. So if you're looking to get started in marketing, I recommend stay away from purchasing traffic from sites like Fiverr and instead focus on building skills, either using some of the free traffic methods that I talk about on my channel or learning how to do online advertising and i also teach that for free on my channel i teach how to do facebook google youtube ads on this channel you can find those videos or you can join my training course where i really go in depth on how to be a marketer and how to get traffic using these methods also suggest you uh subscribe to my channel if you haven't already make sure you enable the notifications i do weekly live streams where i do a question and answer session and i go over with all my folks answering usually common questions that pop up i'm always willing to help and i suggest you join my forum which is there should be a link in the description where you could join our discord chat and you'll see in our forum, we have a lot of different categories, uh, sections that you can write in about and communicate with other people. As you see, there's 65 people live online right now. We have thousands of members and they're all different sorts of discussion areas from the general discussion area to affiliate marketing, e-commerce, Amazon, and just ways to make money with apps, as well as many folks sharing their success stories in making their first dollars online. In this case, oh, I haven't seen some of these, but you know, this person made their first $1,000 through Digistore, very exciting. So we have a lot of members seeing a lot of success. And if you wanna hang out and chat with those people and ask questions, I suggest join the forum, introduce yourself, tell everybody your story. And also, please, I encourage you to share and add more value than you ask. If you have an important question that you want a response to, I would answer three other people's questions first and then ask your own question. Remember, the more you give, the more the universe will give back to you. So always give value first. I want this to be not a community of whiners and people just asking incessant questions. I want this to be a community of hard charging Viking capitalists who are all working together to help everyone make more money together.